Heavenly Father, I just lift up Donald J. Trump to you, and I give him over to you, Father, his life over to you, Father God. And today I want to pray some prayers for Donald J. Trump today from the prayer book, scripture book from John Eckhart called Prayers That Route Demons and Break Curses by John Eckhart. And I'm going to be praying some prayers titled Warfare Prayers over Donald J. Trump, Father God, from the scriptures of your word, Father God, in this book by John Eckhart that I just mentioned earlier. So now I'm going to start. Lord, I ask that you teach Donald J. Trump's hands to war and his fingers to fight according to Psalm 144.1 in Jesus Christ's name. Lord, I thank you that Donald J. Trump is your end times warrior. I ask that you use Donald J. Trump as your weapon against the enemy. In Jesus Christ's name, 2 Chronicles 11.1. The weapons of Donald J. Trump's warfare are not carnal, but mighty through you, Father God, to the pulling down of the strongholds that come against Donald J. Trump's life. In Jesus Christ's name, 2 Corinthians 10.4. Satan, you, you have lost the war the in heaven that come against Donald J. Trump's life. You have you lost the war do. in heaven. Revelations 12, 7. In Jesus Christ's name, Father, I ask that you let all the enemies that make war with the Lamb be destroyed. In Jesus Christ's name, Revelation 17, 14. Father God, I thank you that Donald J. Trump do not war after the flesh, but after the spirit. In Jesus Christ's name, 2 Corinthians 10, 3. Lord, I ask that you thunder upon the enemy that come against Donald J. Trump, Father God, the enemy which is the devil. That you release your voice against the devil and the demons that come against Donald J. Trump's life, Father God, in the spiritual realm. And that you release hell stones and coals of fire against the devil and his demonic cohorts that come against Donald J. Trump, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name. Psalm 18, 3. Psalm 18, 13. Sorry about that. Psalm 18, 13. Father, I ask that you send out your arrows and scatter them. And shoot out your light and discomfort them. That you send out your arrows, Father God, against every demon spirit that come against Donald J. Trump and scatter these demons that come against Donald J. Trump in the spiritual realm and that you will shoot out your light, Father God, and discomfort these demons that come against Donald J. Trump in the spiritual realm in Jesus Christ's name, Psalm 18, 14. Heavenly Father, I ask that you would deliver Donald J. Trump from his strong enemy, from them that are too strong for Donald J. Trump in Jesus Christ's name, Psalm 18, 17. Father, I ask that you would deliver Donald J. Trump and bring Donald J. Trump into a large place, Father, in Jesus Christ's name, Psalm 18, 19. Father God, I thank you that Donald J. Trump is your battle axe and weapon of war, in Jesus Christ's name, Jeremiah 51, 20. Father, I thank you that you have given Donald J. Trump the necks of his enemies, and Donald J. Trump will destroy them in the name of Jesus Christ, Psalm 18, 40. Father, I thank you that Donald J. Trump is your anointed and you give Donald J. Trump great deliverance. Sorry about that. Father, I thank you that Donald J. Trump is your anointed, especially through Jesus Christ, and you give Donald J. Trump great deliverance in Jesus Christ's name, Psalm 1850. Father, I thank you, Father God, that you, Father God, will beat them small as the dust and cast them out as mere in the streets that come against Donald J. Trump in Jesus Christ's name. Donald J. Trump will beat them small as the dust and cast them out as mere in the streets in Jesus Christ's name, Psalm 1842. Father, I thank you, Father God, that Donald J. Trump had pursued his enemies and overtaken them. Donald J. Trump did not turn... A until they were consumed in Jesus Christ's name according to Psalm 1837 Father I thank you that Donald J. Trump have wounded them and they are not able to rise they have fallen under Donald J. Trump's feet and Father I thank you that you have wounded the evil entities and deities that come against Donald J. Trump and they are not able to, uh, to rise against Donald J. Trump Father God in his life in the spiritual realm 
And these demons have fallen under the feet of Donald J. Trump, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, Psalm 1838. Father, I thank you that Donald J. Trump tread upon the lion and the adder, the young lion and dragon, Donald J. Trump trample underfoot in Jesus Christ's name, Psalm 9113. Father, I thank you that Donald J. Trump tread upon serpents and scorpions and over all the power of the enemy, and nothing shall by any means hurt Donald J. Trump in Jesus Christ's name, Luke 10, 19. I thank you, Father God, that Donald J. Trump tread down the wicked, and they are ashes under Donald J. Trump's feet in Jesus Christ's name, Malachi 4, 3. Father, I thank you that Donald J. Trump will arise and thresh and beat the enemy into pieces, according to Micah 4.13 in Jesus Christ's name. Father, I rebuke every wild boar of the field that come against Donald J. Trump in his life in the spiritual realm in the name of Jesus Christ, Psalm 80, verse 13. I rebuke every spirit that creeps forth against Donald J. Trump from the forest in Jesus Christ's name, Psalm 104.20. I rebuke every beast of the force that come against Donald J. Trump that comes to devour Donald J. Trump in Jesus Christ's name, Isaiah 56, 9. I rebuke every line of the force that come to dis that come to slay. I rebuke every line of the force that come to slay Donald J. Trump in the spiritual realm in Jesus Christ's name, Jeremiah 5, 6. I close the door to every demonic rat that will Attempt to come into Donald J. Trump's life in the name of Jesus Christ, Isaiah 66, 17. I bind and cast out every thief that would try to steal Donald J. Trump's finances in the name of Jesus Christ, John 10, 10. I bind and cast out any spirit that would try to steal Donald J. Trump's joy in the name of Jesus Christ. I bind, expose, and cast out any demon that would try by step undetected to come into Donald J. Trump's life, according to 2 Samuel 19, 3, in Jesus Christ's name. I'm going to say this one again. I bind, expose, and cast out any demon that would try by stealth undetected to come into Donald J. Trump's life in Jesus Christ's name. 2 Samuel 19, 3. Lord, I ask that you cleanse Donald J. Trump's temple and drive out any thief in Donald J. Trump's life in Jesus Christ's name. John 2, 14 through 15. Lord, I ask that you lift up a standard against any flood the enemy will try to bring into Donald J. Trump's life in Jesus Christ's name. Isaiah 59, 19. I bind and cast out all familiar spirits that will try to operate in Donald J. Trump's life in the name of Jesus Christ, Isaiah 8, 19. Isaiah 8, 19. I bind and rebuke any demon that will try to block Donald J. Trump's way in the name of Jesus Christ, Matthew 8, 28. I Father, I ask, I remove all leaven of malice and wickedness from Donald J. Trump's life, Father God. In Jesus Christ's name, according to 1 Corinthians 5, 8. Father, I thank you for removing all leaven of malice and wickedness from Donald J. Trump's life, Father God. In Jesus Christ's name, 1 Corinthians 5, 8. I rebuke and cast out any frog-like spirit from Donald J. Trump's life in the name of Jesus Christ, Revelation 16, 13. I bind and rebuke devils in high places that come against Donald J. Trump in the name of Jesus Christ, 2 Chronicles 11, 15. I break off any fellowship with devils through sin, the flesh, and sacrifice that come against Donald J. Trump's life in the name of Jesus Christ and offer his life in Jesus Christ's name, 1 Corinthians 10, 20. Father, I command all devils to lead Donald J. Trump's children and his grandchildren in the name of Jesus Christ, Mark 7, 29. Lord, I ask that you expose any human devils in Donald J. Trump's life in the name of Jesus Christ, John 6, 70. Lord, I ask that you expose any children of the devil that would try to come into the church in Jesus Christ's name, Acts 13, 10. And Father, I ask that you expose anyone where in the political arena where Donald Trump works, Father God, that would try to attempt to come into the White House or any arena that Donald J. Trump is working politically, 
politically in Jesus Christ's name as well. I ask, Father God, that you let every spirit hiding from Donald J. Trump be exposed in the name of Jesus Christ, Joshua 10, 16. I ask, Father God, that you let every hidden snare for Donald J. Trump's feet be exposed in Jesus Christ's name, Jeremiah 18, 22. Father, I stand against and rebuke. I stand against and rebuke every wow of the devil that come against Donald J. Trump in his life in Jesus Christ's name. Ephesians 6 11. I release Donald J. Trump from any snare of the devil in the name of Jesus Christ. 2 Timothy 2 26. Father, I thank you that Donald J. Trump will not come into the condemnation of the devil in Jesus Christ's name. 1 Timothy 3 6. Father, Lord, I ask that you let no doctrine of the devil be established in Donald J. Trump's life in Jesus Christ's name. 1 Timothy 4 1. I nullify the power of any sacrifice made to devils in Donald J. Trump's city, region, and nation in the name of Jesus Christ and in his neighborhood as well wherever he lives in Jesus Christ's name. Leviticus 17, 7. I bind and rebuke Molech and any spirit that has been assigned to abort Donald J. Trump's destiny in Jesus Christ's name. Leviticus 18:21. Heavenly Father, I ask that you will give Donald J. Trump strength to bring forth his destiny in Jesus Christ's name, Isaiah 66, 9. I thank you, Father God, that Donald J. Trump overcome every antichrist spirit because greater is he that is in Donald J. Trump than he that is in the world. Greater are you that is in Donald J. Trump than he that is in the world, Father God, which would be the devil. 1 John 4, 4, 5. I thank you, Father God, that Donald J. Trump overcome every antichrist spirit because greater is you, Father God, that is in Donald J. Trump than the devil that is in this world, Father. First John 4, verses 4 to 5. I loose Donald J. Trump from every spirit of error in the name of Jesus Christ. First John 4, 6. Lord, let Donald J. Trump not operate in the wrong spirit. In Jesus Christ's name, Luke 9.55. I loose Donald J. Trump from every spirit of whoredom in the name of Jesus Christ. Hosea 4.12. Let Donald J. Trump have and walk in and that let Donald J. Trump have and walk in an excellent spirit. In Jesus Christ's name, Daniel 6.3. I'm back. Father, I thank you, Father God, that Donald J. Trump will take heed to his spirit at all times. In Jesus Christ's name, Malachi 2.15. I bind and cast out any spirit that would try to tear apart Donald J. Trump's life in any manner. In the name of Jesus Christ, Mark 9.20. Lord, I ask that you stir up Donald J. Trump's spirit to do your will, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name. Haggai 1.14 I bind and cast out any demon of slumber from Donald J. Trump's life in the name of Jesus Christ. Romans 11.8 I bind and cast out all demons of fear and timidity that come against Donald J. Trump's life in the name of Jesus Christ and that come against Donald J. Trump in the name of Jesus Christ. 2 Timothy 1, 7. I bind and cast out all seducing spirits that would come Donald J. Trump's way in the name of Jesus Christ. 1 Timothy 4, 1. I bind and rebuke the angel of light that come against Donald J. Trump in the spiritual realm in the name of Jesus Christ. 2 Corinthians eleven fourteen. Father, I thank you that Donald J. Trump reject all false apostolic ministries in the name of Jesus Christ. 2 Corinthians 11, 13. Father, I thank you that Donald J. Trump reject all false prophetic ministries in the name of Jesus Christ. Matthew 7, 15. I thank you, Father God, that Donald J. Trump reject all false teaching ministries in the name of Jesus Christ. 2 Peter 2, 1. Father, I ask that you expose all false brethren to Donald J. Trump in Jesus Christ's name and all false people that come against Donald J. Trump too, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, 2 Corinthians eleven twenty six. I thank you, Father God, that Donald J. Trump reject the mouth of vanity and the right hand of falsehood in Jesus Christ's name, Psalm 144, 8. 
I thank you, Father God, that Donald J. Trump...